Hey everyone, welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. In the last episode, we took on the mid-boss and got the double claw shot, which is better than the single claw shot. And in this episode, we're going to head back to the room where the red-eyes dragon thing destroyed the destroyed the uh, bridge. Because now that we can, now that we have the double claw shot, we can go back over there and we can get some treasure chests and some other exciting stuff. And if you can, re could. Uh, remember a couple videos ago we couldn't go exactly do everything we could over here but now we got P hats which makes us able to go over here yay and we can also take that take that you will not live now we can come on in here and let's go back in here but yeah the cl double claw shots awesome only in two games so far, but I'm assuming they might bring it back in the Wii U games since it's been in the bunch of the 3D games. And yes, this is a blue rupee. Hi, blue rupee. How are you today? I'm doing good. Okay. Now we can uh, jump down here. And as you can see, we got these claw shot targets, which we can claw shot on over here. Come on, go. Now we go. Wait, what? Wait, where is it? Uh, oh. Just, like going go down here uh, yeah that would have been bad if if there was nothing for us to go cuz uh, yeah we'd be screwed and yeah now we're over here on this side which is interesting uh, there's a trust chest over there can go over here we take this on and we also got these guys wow we missed Joe we missed and you're dead don't go that way Yo, now let's see what's in this chest. I believe it's ten rupees. Or arrows. Arrows work too. That that works too. For some reason I thought it was ten rupees. I don't know why. Uh anyways, let's uh let's cross over here. Yeah, so uh this dungeon uh it's very hard, very confusing. There's one part later that I always get mixed up to. Um like exactly how to get to the boss door. That's like always the part I get confused. But yeah, it's a very big dungeon, so we probably at least have three videos to go on this. So hopefully, hopefully it takes two, but we'll see. And now where do we go? It, it'll certainly take like 50 if we, if I don't know where to go. But at least we can go down here. Wait, are we on the other side of that treasure? We might be actually. Um, on these guys, these guys are mean. Uh, we don't want to claw shot up there yet. Kill him. Come on. Come on. Link. Aim. That's not aiming, Link. There we go. And, and your turn to fall into a pit of nothingness. At least you only took one. Now, um, let's see. We got this door here. I don't think we need it for anything. Or wait. Dude, we have this switch here. That opens that door. Is there anything on the other side? Oh, just that, okay. Can't do that yet. There we go. Now let's cross on over here. Keep on claw shotting. I mean, geez, that's that's all we seriously are doing right now. <laughs> it's kind of weird. Like, there's so many claw shot panels. Like, I don't know why anyone would build. Like, the Akka, like, I know they can fly, but just, I don't know why they build, like, put all these claw shot targets here. go. Now we can collect this treasure chest over here by hopping on over. And being careful, you don't want to fall off. That Now is not the time to fall off. Seriously, that's like the worst time. And there's 20 rupees. I almost fell off right there by not looking. But there we go. Uh, let's see. There's also treasure chest over there. Oh, you again. And you will die. Never to be seen again. I want. Wait, did he land? No. Yeah, he might have landed actually. That's kind of weird. I don't know how they. I don't know how you would live after that fall, but you know where exactly does the uh, where exactly like do these bottomless pits go to? That's something I've always wondered. We got bombs here, but seriously, where do those bottomless pits go? Like in like just every. I mean, how did you come up here? You were like all the way down there. 
You couldn't have possibly jumped all the way up here and lived. That makes no sense. Just go die and never come back. That's kind of mean when you think about it, but seriously. You should not be able to, like, hop that high to get up here. Oh, well. Let's just go into this circular room. We got kind of a mini-boss here. It's the big Deku Baba thing from the Forest Temple. But he's... Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez! Uh, okay, thanks for shooting us down this the hole. Okay, let's try this again. Uh, yeah. That did not work out well. And there we go. Okay. Had to do that. Go. Dead. You're dead too. And, the, and just like last time, the giant uh, plant thing opens up. Go. Go. Uh, let's see. Where are some bombs? Oh, we have bombs. That's right. We don't need. We don't need to find bombs. We have bombs. So this is like the first time we're actually using the bombs. Blow that up, and that should give us a small key, maybe. Just like last time. Maybe. Maybe. Did that do nothing? That did nothing. Let's go, you. Now, um, let's see. There we go. Maybe closer. Do, do, do. Shut up, you Waka. I don't know why you're making those weird sounds, but whatever. Now, up here we got some... Did I miss a treasure chest in another room? Uh, okay, whatever. I don't care, but seriously. Like, like, watch. That's like a heart piece or something. No, that's like a, that's like a power-up that's like game-breaking. It's like the... It's like It makes our like 17 hearts double to 34. That, that's how powerful that item that I missed is. And here's 10 rupees. Uh, again, useless 10 rupees, because we'll probably never need exactly 10 rupees ever again. And we also got this treasure chest. Oh, jeez! Okay, um, don't use the mortal draw like that, kitties. And we got to this part. We got this little, like, uh, little, like, platforming section here, and we just... Wait, we already got this treasure chest? Huh? When did we get this treasure chest? I don't remember getting this treasure chest. What? Wait a minute. S seriously, when did we get this treasure chest? I don't... I don't remember this. Fine. One less treasure chest for me to collect. Okay, th that was weird. Like, we haven't been in this room yet, have we? I don't remember being in this room. Uh, whatever, let's just... We can, like, kind of shimmy on over this way now. Be careful, hopefully the keystone kill us. That would be bad. They, luckily, they can't aim for crap. And let's head down here. Seriously, when did we get that treasure chest, though? That, like, makes no sense. Yo. No. Jeez, when did you get here? Okay, uh, let's take care of you first. No, wait, don't go back in your thing. Screw you. Just open this. And we got a piece of someone's heart number one! And that luckily puts us all the way back up. Now, wait, I don't think we can get up there, actually. So, we'll shimmy on back. And I, and I have to say, though, if any item could be like made into real life, the coolest one would be the claw shot. I've always said that the claw shot would, or hook shot in other Zelda games would be the coolest item ever. Just like hopping around, especially the double claw shot now. Just hopping around like all over the place, like climbing up crap and stuff. Oh, that'd be freaking awesome. Oh, well, let's just uh, come on over here and let's go up here. Why? Because it's easier to aim for this. Because we need to get him up here now. And let's head down this way. On top of him. 
You will not be fun to deal with. There we go. Perfect. The jump strike strikes again. Get it? The jump strike strikes again. I'm so funny. And he drops 50 rupees. Again, I don't know where he gets all this money. Like, like why is a, a lizard... A walking lizard use money? I don't know. Because logic, apparently. Now we come into this room. And... That's some pots of the house. Pots. Where are you? There you are. You're dead now, son. You're dead. You're going to be dead too, son. Let's see, uh, this room. I remember this room. There's some pea hats somewhere. There's the sun. Hi, son! Don't look directly at the sun or you'll go blind, Link. Oh, whoa. Do we... Sites, didn't we? Now we gotta wait for this pihat. That's a problem because, yeah, these pihats are moving and they're, yeah, pihats of the friend of American people. I don't know. Now let's see. Uh, don't look directly at the sun. Don't look directly. At I will go to the sun. Claw shot to the sun. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, let's see. I'm confused. Uh, we need to go to this side, don't we? Yes, we do. Kill you! There we go! Then this room. I remember this room being particularly weird. At that... There, uh... I think we want to go this way first. As you can see, there's a postal off there. Yes. Yes! This is defying all Zelda logic, because we need... Oh yeah, by the way, you it's like a, one of those, you know, trying to fit the circle. Y you know how, like, when you were a kid, you had to fit the circle in the circle thing, or square, or something like that? Like the weird puzzle thing? It's kind of like that with this, but, but anyways... Yes, it's clearly sunny, yet postals can live here. I don't get it either. Cuz logic. Cuz logic. That seems to be the theme with this dungeon. So, uh, let's come on over here. I think this is where we want to go first. Um, stop. Turn around. Camera! Fine, whatever. Let's just... You know, let's just go through this door and, and call it a day. We got this long, windy hall of darkness to go through because a lot that happens a lot, but come on in here. As you can see, the wind starts, and we can see kind of over there. We'll be doing dealing with that later, just like everything else. Um, so on across here, across again. We're gonna actually turn around here. Go down this way because, as you saw, oh my God, I almost blew off. Uh, there was a treasure chest over here, and this is an important treasure chest that we do want to collect. Um, open this up, and we got a piece of someone's heart. The second one of the dungeon, yay! Yay! Now we do want to come over here because there is nothing else here. Let me, so we can deal with this postal. And. Wait, once we come up with this. Uh, let's see. Uh, can we not miss? Apparently not. That, apparently that's not an option. Okay, let's take you down now and let's. Finish you like a boss! Yeah! Woo! Postal number something. And yes, trees can grow in the sky. Well, then again, I guess this is heaven, so every logic is, like, thrown out the window. What's up? And this is... A purple rupee! Rupees of 50. 50 rupees. Now, let's see. Let's see, um... Let's see. Where do we go now? P hat. 
P hat. Come to Papa P hat. Um, let's see. Um, come on. Get closer. Thank you. I'm gonna have to go around our way. I uh. Uh, is there treasure chest down here? I don't think so. Oh! God! Okay, uh... I'm gonna deal with these guys, and I will meet you back to the other room where we were trying to go to. Link goes up. Link goes down. Link goes up. Oh my god, the glitchy camera. Hey, we're behind, we're behind the vines. I don't know how that works. I just wanted to be behind some vines. Anyways, let's uh, let's head back here. Now, something I noticed is I think those Helmosauruses are grown-up Helmosaurs, because because like there was like one of them, so it's like probably the parent of those two other Helmosaurs. I don't know. The biology of Zelda enemies, and oh my goodness, that camera. Now let's see. Wait, don't. Okay, uh, please tell me there's an easy way up here. I don't think so. Much. Whoa, okay. Thought there was, there is a treasure chest here. That's what I was thinking. Let's open. Oh, Link, open. Thank you. Thank you, Link. Bombs! Five of them. I'm gonna have to wait, aren't I? Yeah, I'm gonna have to wait. I'll, I'll cut for a little bit so we, you don't have to wait either. No, 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 no. Oh, crap. That was close. Uh, if you didn't... I'm probably going to leave that part in, but I accidentally dropped down to, uh... Wait, crap. Uh, I accidentally dropped down into the... Into the freaking uh... Back to the, like, ground where the treasure chest was. And then I freaking barely grabbed onto the peat hat, and then I, like, grabbed onto the ledge at the last second. Oh, that was close. Now the wind will not blow us away. So now let's head in here to this important room. And let's go in here. So we got these guys here. Oh my goodness. You do, not look, you do not look very friendly. No, I'll take you down. Got him. Okay. You don't want me to take you down, do you? That did not work either. Wow, this guy. This guy is like. This guy's like good with the shield. Screw you, we're leaving. You're no fun. Oh, now you're following me. Well, then you're gonna die. You don't just get to follow me. No enemy gets to just follow me. I'm Link, I'm the hero of this game. Now we can just come up here easily. We don't have to slowly climb. Stay on. Oh, crap, this section. I just remembered this. Uh, this is going to take a while. <laughs> I'm not good at this section. We're going to have to be wolf and kind of sh sneak around here. We've got a lot of treasure chests, too. Let's see. Can I get... Thank you. Now, let's go around this way. Oh, don't jump off, Link! Don't jump off! <laughs> Apparently this is a good way to take loose poles, by the way. Okay, back to where we were. We're going to climb up here. We gotta deal with you. No, don't do that, Link. You're supposed to kill him, not go give him a hug. Nope. Oh, come on! That's not funny. It's not funny, man. It's not funny. Okay, we're back. He's dead. Yay. Let me 
Now this is going to be a tricky kill. Did I get him? Yes, I did. Yay. Oh! Oh! Frickin' scare me, why don't ya? Oh boy, I think I should just... Don't blink! Oh, this is gonna be tough. I want this treasure chest, though, and we're not gonna give up till we get it. There we go, we finally did it. Just, like, come across here. No, don't go down. Down's not where you're supposed to go, Link. Drop on down here. Stay down here. Like this. And this is 20 rupees. We're getting up there on there up in rupees. Yeah. We want to do this. We want to be careful because there's a postal over there. So it's going to be a little bit tricky. Oh, crap. Uh, yeah, this is going to be tricky. We also got this treasure chest there. Hopefully... Luckily, there really isn't much wind here. Where are you? I want to be careful and... Okay, oh crap, that was close. Take you, take you down. And collect the final postal of this dungeon. Number two of this dungeon, that is postal... What postal are we on? We're on 55, wow, five left. I remember back when we got our first postal. Those were the days. And we got 50 rupees. And... That's where we want to go, isn't it? Uh, is there any way for us to, like, easily go over there? Or do I have to literally go around? I think I have to go... I'll meet you over there. Okay, we're gonna have to do this little tight roping section. It took me a while to talk about it, but we're gonna have to do a little tight rope. Now, are you going to? You're just gonna fine. We'll ignore you. That's so. That's cool too. I like. I like that. Now let's uh, kind of crawl across here. And yes, this this is completely necessary. Now let's, uh... Oh, oh, crap. Oh, crap. It was close. Uh... Oh, no, 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 no. Gosh darn it. Okay, well, now that we are over here, I'm going to head into this door, and then I'm going to end off the video. With this lots of win, next time on The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess, we will... Deal with this wind, hopefully. Apparently those things can get through the wind. Thank you very much for watching. That room took forever. I hate that room. Let's never do that room ever again. Wow, that guy's face is through the wall. That's kind of weird. But yeah, we'll never do with the wind ever again. See you next time. Goodbye.